Winglet. Wings. Nose. Nose. Radar. Cockpit. Styles. Weapons. Straps. Slaps. Aileron. Landing. Engine. Double engine. Tail. Rudder. Fuse lodge. Propeller. Stabilizer. Elevator. Roll. Roll. That is the roll. Pitch. Yaw. Bombs. Two parachutes. Parachute. Head up display. Landing gears. Five wheels. Weight on wheels. Training mode. As unique. Paracraft. UAV. Uniform. Bulletproof jacket. Hello my brothers and sisters. Welcome back to this channel. Today we will be learning English related to aircraft including parts of an aircraft. So let's start without wasting further time. This is UAE which is unmanned aerial vehicle. No, we got a shooter, high caliber weapon. Question UAV? Well, who's ever manning these UAV? UAV program. It looks like a sofa. This is the wing and this is the winglet. This tilted one is called the winglet. And this is the wing, this is the winglet. That is also a winglet. With the seatbelt fastened. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Look at its wings. It doesn't have a winglet, I suppose, but it does have a wing. This is the big nose of the aircraft. This is the nose of the aircraft where they will keep the radar, where the radar is present. Radar. Radar is operational, sir. You better take a look at this radar. Instruments are going haywire. Radar is down. So the radar of the enemy gun cannot lock onto you. Is there anything unusual on the radar or scanners? Hank turned that radar installation into a transmitter. And look at that. That is the place where the pilot will be seated. This is the cockpit where the pilot will be seated and, and uh, it will fly this wonderful aircraft. I really like the cockpit especially. There's been a little problem in the cockpit. Make room for a stretcher in the cockpit. Sure. You ever been in a cockpit before? Open cockpit airplane. These are the missiles hanging on the wings. There are many missiles hanging on its wings. See, these are missiles on Su-30 aircraft. This helicopter also has many bombs and missiles to fight with enemies. And you now you see, these are the slats, slats, and slats, slats, slats. And see, the, the, here are the missiles or weapons hanging on the wings. And this is the, this is the aileron, aileron. And if the ailerons start to shimmy, baby, I have flown a plane or two in my life. Rudder aileron trim. Ailerons. Aileron. And what is this? Flaps. Flap. Flaps and drag fins. Flaps too. Flaps. Flaps? Aileron. Oh, wow, Delhi. <laughs> this is the slaps. Here are the flaps, which help in taking off and landing of the aircraft. Look at this. This is the engine of the aircraft. Engine. Engine. This is a single engine aircraft. But there are aircrafts who have two who have two engines just like this one. See? It has two engines. Two engines. So it is double engine aircraft. That is single engine aircraft. It's a marvelous aircraft. I really love these models. And do you know? This is the tail. This is the, and this is the rudder. Rudder is right, 10 degrees. Right rudder. Stick and rudder. You a pilot? Rudder. And this is the fuselage. The body of this uh, aircraft is called the fuselage, which includes the cockpit and these sitting areas. They all, this is the fuselage. Fuselage. This is the fuselage. That's all that's left of the fuselage. On the forward part of the fuselage. With a hole in the fuselage. And this I want no wind resistance on the fuselage. There are fuselage. Where the cockpit is also present and the place where, uh, where people sit is also present. So this together, this portion, the body of the aircraft is called the fuselage. And what is this? This is the four blade propeller. Four blade 
propeller. The propeller. The propeller. Propeller. Why doesn't the propeller stay still? This is a propeller. This is a propeller. And this aircraft has six blade propeller. One, two, three, four, five, six. This is six blade propeller. I cannot move this propeller, but it is a five blade propeller. And this whole portion is called tail. This is the rudder. This is the vertical stabilizer. This is the horizontal stabilizer. And this is the elevator. This is the elevator. This is the horizontal stabilizer. This is the vertical stabilizer. And this is the rudder. So this whole portion is called tail. So this is the tail of the aircraft. Fuselage. Wings. And these two are its wings. And you know about the movements of the aircraft? See, when the aircraft moves like this, like this, like this, then it is like this, see, like this, like this. So this is called roll. Roll, that is the roll. And when it goes like this, see, like this, it is called pitch. And when it goes like this, like this, it is called yaw. This is the yaw. Yaw is okay. Control the pitch yaw and roll. Your dampers on and operating. The yaw pitch and roll to give us the exact position and orientation of our baby. Adjusting the yaw. This is the yaw. Yaw. This is the pitch. And this is the roll. Roll. I hope you understood. Wow! Look at these missiles. 250 kg missiles. They are really, really big missiles. This aircraft is smaller than the previous one. See, this is the parachute, which helps the aircraft in landing over a short distance. Generally, aircraft take the, take the whole runway to land. But when they use a parachute, it takes lesser distance to land. Look at this. This is called the brake parachute for LCA Tejas. Wow! Look at all this brake parachute for Su 30. It has two parachute size. See? Two parachutes. They will show this in the display time. Do you know what is this? This is the head up display for LCA. Here the it is present in the cockpit where the pilot sits and look through, look through it. So this is called head up display for LCA. Head up display for LCA. Now look at these, these are engines I think. Now see. This is the engine of an aircraft. This is a big aeroplane where passengers or I would say soldiers can sit and they will take the soldiers or passengers from one place to the other. You know? That aircraft was nothing but this aircraft. It is a very big aircraft. And you know how many wheels it has? It has five wheels! Five wheels, you know? It's a very big aircraft. And it has uh, four engines. Two in this, two uh, here, two on the other side. See, there here's the engine of the aircraft, which is on the wings, which is hanging on the wings. But, uh, but for small aircrafts, where the wings uh, will be, I mean, I can say that they will be small, for there, the engine will be present just below the body. Here, they will be, it will be present. Single engine aircraft, double engine aircraft. In some aircrafts, there will be one seat where only one pilot can be seated. But in some, there are two seats where two pilots can be seated. One is the main pilot, who will be, who will be, you know, flying the aircraft, whereas there will be the other pilot who will be guiding this person. He is in 
training mode and this person will be flying the aircraft just like when we drive a car there will be one person who will be driving the car whereas there will be there will be another person seated beside you and that person will guide you how to drive the car similarly in an aircraft also there will be one person sitting over here and he will be in a training mode and he will be guiding this other other person to drive the uh, to to fly the aircraft this aircraft has three wheels one is in front and the other two are at the back this is its landing gear landing gear i'm putting the landing gear down now landing gear deployed trouble with the landing gear and do you know this aircraft is just like our tricycle tricycle not bicycle tricycle because in our tricycle also wheels are placed in a similar manner interestingly in this helicopter there are two wheels at the front and one wheel at the back two wheels front and one wheel back just opposite to the aircraft we saw in which there was one wheel at the front and two wheels at the back this is this is really opposite here one wheel at the back and two wheels at the front this aircraft is weight on wheels weight on wheels means the whole weight of the aircraft is on the wheels for that we call weight on wheels but when the aircraft will be flying for that we use the aircraft is not on weight on wheels means the aircraft's whole weight will not be on its wheels but when it's like this and then we can use weight on wheels the aircraft is weight on wheels means its whole weight is on its wheels look at that aircraft the aircraft is not on weight on wheels this is a helicopter which is weight on wheels when the aircraft flies it takes its wheels inside it unlike our car in our car we cannot take the wheels inside I wish I could take the wheels inside our car and just fly the car just like an aircraft but there will be traffic jam in the air itself see this is the cockpit where the pilot will be seated this is a different kind of aircraft or something else i think it does looks like this right like this or i would say like this i really like this unique kind of aircraft or whatever it is look the engine looks like this i think its skin has been removed all the skin is not present it's not there but see this is the engine so many wires and pipes and don't know don't know what what so many this is also a an aircraft a kind of aircraft i don't know whatever it really is see these are uav we call it a drone these all are uav unmanned aerial vehicle where there will be no man sitting it will be controlling with a remote just like our remote car but it will be flying it will be controlled by our remote and it will fly and spy on other enemies kingdom or enemies place so this is uav unmanned aerial vehicle these all are uav it's just like a drones there will be no man sitting inside instead there will be a man controlling it on the ground itself and this uav will go to other places the enemy's places and spy and take information from whatever for uh, take information from the enemy's place and tell us whatever is going on over there see this is the parachute this is a special kind of uniform made for soldiers to live in that kind of environment which kind of environment this kind of environment when there will be snowfall see like himalayas and all there will be a lot of snowfall so for that or for that soldiers wear this kind of uniform to survive in that area look at this i like this parachute we this man is swinging i should not touch it i think so i can go see this is the bullet proof jacket 
bullet resistant jacket for soldiers thank you so much for watching this video if you have learned a little bit more english through this video then don't forget to like share and subscribe to this channel bye bye see you in the next video